The Hall of Fame for the Trotter is located in Goshen, New York. Historic track. You've raced there many times. I very seldom ever missed a year there since I started racing. Do they still race at uh, Goshen? Oh, historic? yes. They have a grand circuit meeting there the week of the 4th of July every year. Mm -hmm. Isn't that also where they have the final for the amateur Billings Classic in the Spring Series? That's right. And it was a home of Roland Harriman who really took the game when it was really down and put it back together, bought the hook beats, bought all the registers, and just set the game up. He was a son of W. A. Harriman, the great railroad magnet, and he was president of the railroad himself. Now, uh, at Goshen, in the home of the Hamiltonian for a number of years, where it actually got its start. Yes, but the historic track, there was two tracks at Goshen. Two. There was a mile track where they raced the Hamiltonian, mm -hmm. and this was the historic track, the half mile track, and the other track is gone since the Hamiltonian left. Historic track is still there, and they've uh, done a wonderful job with it. Mr. Harriman left it to the city of Goshen. When they had both the mile and the half mile, did they have race meets at each track? They'd have a grand circuit meeting at each track about two or three, four weeks apart. Let's take a look at some rare footage from the early 30s of Historic Track, Goshen, New York. Historic Track, just a picturesque setting. Oh, Roger's beautiful. It was a, a training track, and also they raced there. Mr. Harriman would they'd break their colts there in the fall of the year and go to Florida, then bring them back there. And Mr. and Mrs. Harriman both enjoyed training and driving in that and amateur races themselves. How many horses would probably train there? Oh, I would say between there and at the uh, mile track, they would fill up all the stalls. There's three or 400 stalls. Historic track, Goshen, New York.